I'm Ami Horowitz and chaos is breaking out in Portland, which means we're gonna go check it out. For weeks, Portland has seen Black Lives Matter protests nightly in front of the federal courthouse. The mainstream media would have you think that these protests are peaceful and they simply want to stop police brutality. Nothing could be further from the truth. Many of them were hardcore rioters who were using pipes, hammers, and even golf clubs to break down the protective shielding of the building and to bust through. They repeatedly used incendiary devices in order to create multiple fires in the hope of burning the building down and everyone inside. Despite what the media would have you believe, the crowd continuously urged them to continue their mayhem. And I did not observe a single protester discouraging the rioters from what they were doing. Only when the federal building was in danger of burning down and its occupants were threatened did the federal officers come out to extinguish the threat and did so as humanely as possible using tear gas, pepper spray, and other non-lethal means, even after they were attacked with glass, bottles, and rocks. At one point, I was hit by a propelled gas canister. There were groups of people interrogating journalists. They warned me that if I portrayed the protesters in a negative light, I would face street justice. And after being recognized, I was pelted with broken glass. In the words of the protesters that I spoke to, the goal of these protests is to encourage societal breakdown so that it could be rebuilt in their own warped image. We haven't declared a revolutionary war. Is that what we need to do? I strongly feel like we do. Do you think chaos is a good tool in order to reshuffle the deck? It's become a useful tool. Chaos has a complete reboot. So do you think that organized chaos will work? Yep. Yes. Yes. Keyword, organized chaos. I think uh, it could be used as a tool. Should we be able to use that chaos to tear down the system and then to ultimately rebuild it? I believe so. Yeah. Is it time for us to end the American experiment and start all over again? Definitely. It's, we failed as, as an American experiment needs to be addressed. Is it time to end the American experiment and then start all over again? I think that we have to burn it down. Do you think it's time to end the American experiment? Yes. Uh, yeah, it is time to end it. Do we need violence as a yes. tool? Yes. Yes. You gotta have violence. Do you Our think government. that violence is a legitimate tool in order to make change? There's different, there's four levels of protest. Looting and rioting is part of being protesting. So yes, I do agree that it needs to be there. Do you think that violence like that is a proper response? I think that response is an outcry of being silenced for way too long. Not everyone that night felt the same way as the majority of protesters. I, I don't know no black folks is throwing mur mortars and shit. I don't know no black folks is throwing bombs over the fence. I have nothing to do with us. That don't have nothing to do with us. What, 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 what you gonna do if you're 90 years old and you're out there going, hey, 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 and then you throw a bomb, some kid throw a bomb in there trying to be cute like that. And when they come out and they're pissed, and then people would say, look, you see what they did? No, bro, they didn't do nothing. You're going in their dwelling. They're protecting their dwelling. Yeah, and then when, when everybody gets to go home, we stay black, homie. And we get blamed for your black life matter. That's the realest ever. I, 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 this is bullshit. We got 2% black people out here, too. 2%. Two. 2%. What does that say? What's that say? It says, um, Y'all don't know what you, y'all don't believe, y'all really know what you're fighting for. I don't. So this is us taking the high road. This is us not creating groups to, to kill off and assassinate uh, the people that are doing the same to us. This is us just trying to create a world filled with love and kill off the hate.